Hello and what's going on guys, so today I'm going to show you how to install Superman ROM on your Galaxy S7 or S7 Edge. So the first thing that you should know is that for this method to work you must have a rooted phone and uh, have a custom recovery installed. So uh, you open up the XDA thread, you're going to see stuff. You're going to see stuff that you're going to have to read. But uh, in order to install the ROM you have three instructions but I'm gonna give you another another video instruction so you're gonna uh, open up the beginners instructions and uh, you'll see that you're gonna need the latest Odin bootloader and modem you're gonna go ahead and download them I already have bootloader and modem downloaded but I'm gonna download Odin So uh, just because I have them already downloaded on my laptop, I'm not going to download bootloader and modem. But uh, as you can see over here, uh, this is uh, the website uh, that I can download Odin from. Uh, links uh, to everything as always is down below in my description. You're going to need the latest Samsung USB drivers installed. Uh, as well so when you download Odin uh, and you close out all of your unnecessary tabs uh, you're gonna unzip Odin extract it I mean uh, when you have extracted Odin you're gonna have to uh, turn off your phone And once you have turned your phone off, uh, when you see the lights go off, you are going to have to press volume down, uh, power and home button together and hold them for a few seconds till you see this screen, this blue screen. Now you're going to have to press volume up to continue. Once you continue this step, you're going to have to plug in your phone and open up Odin. Uh, and let me just do that in a second uh, I, I open up Odin and you'll see this screen you're gonna have to press BL and open the place you downloaded bootloader and modem add the file with the BL to the BL section and CP to CP section this is basically your bootloader and modem please make sure you do this the right way uh, so you wouldn't mess up your phone so basically the file that starts with CP goes into CP and BL to BL now you press start this is gonna flash a uh, bootloader and modem on your phone uh, then your phone is gonna reboot itself into TWRP recovery or whatever of a recovery you have installed so you will uh, now have to uh, wipe your phone but first let me sh tell you something you, we haven't yet if you haven't yet downloaded the file you're gonna first of all unplug your phone go ahead download the ROM let's go ahead and do that in a second just because I have it downloaded on my phone uh, on my phone doesn't mean you do but if you do you can just skip a few seconds of this video so you download the file of the ROM the zip file I have it already downloaded on my phone on my laptop so you go ahead and uh, you should copy the file into your external storage or uh, OT, uh, some kind of OTG or whatever you like you just shouldn't be in your internal storage because we are gonna wipe that in a second so you go ahead copy the file into your micro SD card or your OTG flash drive uh, and once you did that you'll be good to go just um, for if you don't already know this once you're in the recovery you can go ahead and plug in your phone as you can see and copy stuff around so you're good to go don't worry if you haven't done this already like I didn't 
So you go ahead, you copy this. Don't copy it into your internal storage. So uh, now, if you have or if you haven't already, you must decrypt your phone. For that, you press uh, on wipe format data and type in yes and it will reboot back you do this part of the advanced wipe uh, I'm sorry uh, that I didn't show this in the video I totally forgot but I wrote it down for you and I sh explained this for you uh, so you should be good to go you open up your external SD card that you have your ROM installed in there now you're gonna uh, see uh, this screen and after that aroma installer will load up since all aroma installer is uh, your prefer preferences it's your personal preferences for this ROM, uh, for this ROM I will just I've just fast forwarded this part for you so that I wouldn't take away your precious time So once you hit install, this is going to take about a minute uh, for uh, the ROM to be installed like, uh, like before. I have fast forwarded, forwarded this part for you. Now you see you press next, you swipe to unlock and you reboot the system. The initial boot will take about five six or seven minutes so don't worry it will take time just make sure that before you're gonna install the ROM just make sure that you have enough battery on your phone maybe like more than 50% of battery is needed so uh, thanks for watching guys uh, I hope you, I really hope you enjoyed this video if you enjoy these types of videos please make sure to subscribe uh, if you like this video please uh, press thumbs up and share this video with your friends and family people who need this type of videos uh, if you had any questions please make sure to ask them uh, in the comment section I will try to answer all of the comments thanks for watching see you guys in the next video